Hello. Hi. You excited? <laughs> it's a big day Just today. It is a big day today. Sean's really, I'm really excited, but Sean's really, really excited. Since Narrowboat Silver Fox came over from Aintree, she's been shot blasted, she's had a layer of kind of sealing epoxy primer, and then she's been sanded and primed and painted and polished and all the bits and pieces put on. You can tell from this camera angle, we're not actually giving much away. You can probably see by Sean's face, looking round, <laughs> how excited he is. So today in this vlog, this is part two of the paint job vlogs. We just want to show you the kind of journey to today. Since last time, blacking has been done. Uh, we've used the international uh, blacking, the brand. Uh, it's really good stuff. Got several coats on it, it's really thick. And of course, in the bow thruster tube, uh, really well protected. I've heard some nightmare stories about these things kind of rusting inside and holes appearing. And even like stories of boats sinking because of it. Uh, so I've been keeping an eye on that. Really glad that's well protected. Uh, we've got the uh, drain for the bow locker just here. And you can probably just see a, an anode just in that corner down there. On the gunnels, it looks like it's the same black as we've got on the blacking down here. It's not, it is a different paint. This paint we've got on the gunnels is the same matte black that we've got on the roof. 
and we've got this anti-slip coating running all the way down the sides too. On the stern, we've got this anti-slip coating and it goes right away around the stern, uh, except the deck boards, which are anti-slip anyway. Engine controls are all there and the bow thruster. And if we just come down to this side, you can see another couple of plugs on the top of the navigation light. We've got a USB charger and a 12 volt charger. And then we've got the shore hookup below that. Up on the roof, we've got five of these flexible photovoltaic panels. These are bonded to the roof of the boat. Each one's 120 watts, so we've got 600 watts worth on the roof, and that'll keep the batteries uh, topped up. What do you think then? Shiny, shiny. Uh, we love it. We absolutely love it, as you can probably tell from the expression on our faces. She's got 95 litres of paint. Buckets full. Buckets and buckets from the uh, blacking right up to the roof. 800 sanding discs used to sand between coats. Nearly 800 man hours already of work just from it arriving and being sandblasted to get to this stage today. And lots more work to come. All the internal fit out starts next week and we're gonna keep you up to date with that. If you've liked the vlog, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. It doesn't cost anything. Click the notifications icon and we'll let you know every time we release a new vlog. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. See you later, bye. Sean's bumped it already and we haven't got it out at sheds yet. Wow. Oh god, it's slippy. Up on the roof. <laughs> Up on the roof, we've got five of these flexible uh, goats. <laughs> 95. Uh. Uh. Keep it, you know. <laughs> Yorkshire board, Yorkshire bread. Strong in the arm, thick in head. It was fast. <laughs>